for the Gambia, it is not personal, it is not even partisan, I dare say, because the objective is for a better Gambia. All we are asking for is the, for the borough administration to take reports of corruption seriously and to take drastic legal steps against the pilfering of public funds, against the wastage of public resources, because corruption kills. Corruption kills just like corruption killed 66 Gambian children due to AKI. What happened? Those who are supposed to regulate the pharmacies are giving their licenses to pharmacies. That is corruption. It messes up the entire intensive incentive mechanism that led to the killing of more than 66 Gambians. That is corruption. But corruption also kills economic growth and it kills job creation. Resources that are supposed to be deployed into the private productive sectors to employ our young people are being used for personal gain illegally. So corruption kills jobs. Unfortunately, this is a country with skyrocketing youth unemployment rates. Coupled with deportation of young people from Europe, Adama Barra and the youth minister Bakari Baji don't even have an idea what real actual statistics are about youth unemployment. Neither do they have a desire to solve it. And Adama Barra and his youth minister Bakari Baji don't have any prop programs or plans to create jobs for the young people of this country. And this is all aided and abated by corruption. So I am really proud of the UDP youth wing and the entire Gambian youth population because there are non-UDP members here. There are non-partisan Gambians who came here for the Gambia, for justice, for fair play. Because at the end of the day, our democracy cannot just be about casting votes and shouting for our political party leaders. Our democracy should also entail the justified, justifiable, fair use of public resources. And those resources are very scarce in this country. This is a country that is operating a chronic fiscal deficit, a country that is borrowing at cutthroat rates to finance a deficit, has no business wasting public resources through corruption. We need an end to this. Congratulations to the UTP Youth Wing, and I want to thank and congratulations and congratulate all the media outfits here present. You all did this for yourselves. You all did this for the Gambia. The Gambia is the winner in this. To the Gambia ever through. Thank you very much.